And 51 8 we know that 8 is equal to 5 plus 3 and when we go back to the table between the Arabic numerals and the Roman numerals we know that 5 is written as a V and 3 is written as 3 I's so we got A equal V with 3 I 13 13 is equal to 10 plus 3 10 is represented by x and 3 is represented by 3 i's. 10, 10 is represented by 1x. 37 is equal to 30 plus 7. So that means we know that 30 is written by 3 axes. 7 can be split up into 5 plus 2. So we put the 5 and 2, 2 i's. 51 equal 50 plus 1. You know that 50 is written in Roman as an L and 1 is an I. Table with R numerals and Roman numerals with you next to you in the first time so that you can practice it better and once you practice it and you get it right you, you won't be needing that table much anymore since it's already memorized in your mind so XV so if we go back to Roman from the Roman numerals to Arabic numerals we have that we know that XV is equal to 10 x is a 10 and v is a 5 so 10 plus 5 is basically equal to 15 x v i is equal to x is a 10 v is a 5 and i is a 1 so we got 10 plus 5 plus 1 which is equal to 15 plus 1 is also equal to 16 l s v we know that l is a 50 x is 10 v is 5 50 plus 10 plus 5 equals 60 plus 5 equals 65 i x this is the special case we know that i is smaller than x so we will just subtract 10 from 1 and that's how we get i x equal to 9 x i x Another special case. We focus first on the i x. Notice that i is the smallest value that is on the left. So we subtract the big value x. We take x first, then minus one i. We got a nine, and then we add the other x ten. We got nine plus ten equal ninety. the nearest tenth 0.83 we put the bracket on the 8 since that's the first number that comes right out after the decimal point and then we have the 3 we notice that 3 is less than 5 so we drop the 3 and we leave the bracket to number as it is 0.83 rounds off to 0 0.8 0 0.34 same technique we put the bracket number on the brackets on the 3. We notice that 4 is less than 5. We drop the 4 and the bracketed number stays as is. 0.34 rounds off to 0 0.3. 0.19. The brackets will be on the 1. We notice that 9 is greater than 5, so we increase the bracket number by 1. 0.19 rounds off to 0.2. So we 
count well two three put the brackets on the four and we have a five which is also equal to five so that means the bracket number will increase by one so 0.545 runs to 0.55 0.737 we put brackets on the 3 we notice that 7 is greater than 5 we increase bracket number by 1 0.737 rounds off to 0.74 1.680 we put the brackets on the 8 0 is less than a 5 we drop off the 0 and we leave the bracket get number as it is 1.680 rounds off to 1.68 so those are a few practice cases about Roman numerals and uh, rounding of decimals it's basically just a few it's reviewing a few concepts before we go deeper about the nursing math program so I thank you all for taking the time to watch us on YouTube MathWiz YouTube channel which I truly appreciate and uh, don't forget to comment subscribe like and share and if you have any questions about the practice problems if you have any comments suggestions please drop back them back on the Facebook YouTube Instagram or Twitter page and I'll do my very best to respond to you promptly so thank you for taking the time to watch us today and have a wonderful day and a great weekend and see you next week with uh, new concepts about nursing math. Bye-bye.